and feeling good. So I am sure everybody is wondering where the heck have I been? I haven't put up any videos in over a week or longer, um, probably two weeks. And uh, yeah, this isn't clickbait. This isn't make believe or whatever. Um, basically, I've been sick as a dog. And today is the first day I have felt good enough to get outside. And right now we're just going on a drive. Um, it's raining. Or I would be in frostbite doing this. Much rather be in frostbite right now driving it. But it's raining. And uh, not going to take the chance driving frostbite in the rain with drag radials and front skinnies on. Not going to do it. But anyway, what happened? Me and my wife both ended up catching COVID. No, no joke. Uh, we both tested positive. Um, we got our results back over about a week ago. And uh, basically since last Tuesday, I have been just completely sick as a dog. The sickest I have ever felt in my life in a long time. Um, you know, a lot of people have gotten this virus and it not really bother them at all. I got family members that has gotten it and all they noticed was they lost their smell or something like that and uh, kind of just got like a cold out of it. It knocked me down pretty bad. Um, last Tuesday, basically, I got up, I went to work, I noticed I was kind of feeling a little off, felt a little sick. And what felt like to me just a normal cold or sinus infection or a sinus thing building up, building up. Well, by the rest of the, by the time uh, I'd say lunchtime came around about 12 o'clock midday, I was really feeling bad. Like, I mean, it just went you know, real, down real quick. Um, so I ended up taking my lunch and I went and got a cheap thermometer from the Kroger and took my temperature and I was actually running a low fever. So decided it was probably time we needed to go home, get away from work, go get tested. So we, me and my wife, she was feeling the same as well. Uh, she wasn't running a fever, but she was feeling not so well as also. Um, and so we both met up and went and seen the doctor the same time that Tuesday. This is by about four o'clock now, by the time we actually got to uh, see the doctor and get both of us tested. And I was really, really down in the dumps by that time. Absolutely no energy. I could barely function. Just did not want to do anything besides literally lay around. I mean, it, it drained me so bad. Um, for two, I'd say for three, three solid days, I was running a fever, not a high fever. Most of the time, it barely even hit. Um, it never even got to 101. It was usually in the hundreds, and uh, that was about it. But just enough to make you feel like crap, and uh, definitely drain you down. Not to mention, you know, all the sinus pressure I was getting and congestion um, was not fun. Definitely was not fun. This has been. I want to say we're on day uh, 10 right now, and I'm just now starting to, I'd say I, f I feel pretty good, I feel pretty good, but up until a couple days ago, it was not fun at all, guys, definitely not fun. Um, I would not wish this virus upon my worst enemy. Um, best way to put it is I would rather have gotten say the flu or, or some sort of sickness that you know hits you hard you know but it's it's gone and over with in a couple few days this thing sucked ass i mean it literally knocked me down for 10 days i mean it, it was it was a solid six to seven days in the bed i mean i'm not even joking before i'd get up and just be able to do anything um just absolutely terrible and I know it could have been so much worse a lot of people have you know really a lot worse side effects than what I got uh, 
puts him in the hospital or whatever. And yeah, all I'm saying is it wasn't fun. Definitely try to be careful out there and do what you can to not get it. Um, again, some people not a big deal. It doesn't bother them at all. Others, it, it's a real, really bad thing. Um, like between me and my wife, she got it and it, it didn't really bother her as much as it bothered me. It did knock her down, um, but it seemed like she didn't get as bad as the side effects that I was getting. And she was up and moving around before I was. Um, definitely don't know what the difference was, but it, it really did a big difference compared to me to her. She didn't really get the fever either. Um, I don't think she actually ran a fever at all. There may have been one day where she was close to running a fever, but not not really. She just got the congestion and the headache part of it. Um, I pretty much got every symptom they say you get. Um, lost my smell, lost taste, uh, got the fever, uh, congestion, super bad. And the, the worst thing about it, guys, was honestly, it was the burning sensation I was getting in my sinus area. It was just absolutely horrible. Um, best way to describe it would be like, I don't know, crushing up cough drops and trying to snort them. It was just like this worst menthol, um, just burning sensation, just all through my nose, all through my face, eyeballs, everything. It sucked. We're uh, feeling much better and I'm ready to get back to the normal grind. Um, I do have a video to put up that I realized, I didn't even realize I never posted it. Um, so there will be another video coming here maybe today. I might throw it up tomorrow. Uh, but it's the new wheels. Uh, the new wheel and tire package we put on. Um, I did the video before we got sick. And I, I haven't even looked at my phone or been on hardly any social media for the last 10 to 12 days just because I have felt so bad that I didn't even care look about looking at my phone. I mean, it, <laughs> the only thing I thought about was literally laying in the bed and getting over this stuff. Um, so I have a lot of messages to catch up on, lots of emails. Um, surprisingly, the channel's done very good through this two week adult period with me really not uploading anything. Um, lots of other videos was getting a lot of attention over the holidays, so definitely happy for that. Um, other thing guys, it's late, but Merry Christmas to everybody. Hope you guys had a great one. For me, it was kind of rough. Um, I got four kids and my youngest one is five. He just turned five on Christmas Eve. My birthday is actually the 23rd, so I just had a birthday as well. And of course, we contracted this COVID virus before the holiday, so it really ruined me and my family's whole plan for this couple weeks, because I'm actually on vacation as well. I took my vacation. I usually put in vacation for Christmas time every year. And uh, other than a good time of having my vacation put in, to be able to get well and get over this virus, but it's absolutely ruined everything. Um, we had a lot of Christmas shopping we didn't get to finish. So my oldest daughter, she, she got gypped the most, I hate to say it. Um, but she knows and as soon as we can get back to the store, we're gonna definitely catch her up um, But yeah, I mean it it killed our Christmas it, it killed my birthday. It killed my son's birthday and It has definitely been a suck the last couple weeks and came at the worst time possible um, But that's what's been going on just wanted to let you guys have an update and uh, this is the first day I have felt good enough to be able to do something like this. Um, last couple days I've been, I was coughing a lot. It was hard to talk sometimes because when I try to talk, I get the urge to cough or whatever. And I just, I didn't want to put up no video of being a cough festival. So, again, feeling a lot better. And hope everybody out there had a good Christmas. Just a quick update, what's been going on, 
And uh, like I said, I'll have a video up here soon on a new wheel and tire package on Frostbite. Definitely looks awesome. And I'm definitely loving the new look that Frostbite has right now. That is for sure. More than that, I can't wait to get some track passes on the new setup. These wheels and tires are lighter and the front, we went much skinnier. So it should knock some time off for sure. But stay tuned. That video will be up very soon, right behind this one. As always, guys, stay safe out there. Definitely stay safe. Try to avoid this virus as much as possible is the best advice I can give you. I hope I never get it again. That's all I can say. But heck yeah, stay tuned. I'm going to be definitely cranking some videos out here in the next couple weeks. Uh, got a lot of stuff planned. A lot of things that has to get done. And definitely have some very good videos coming up very soon. And we're going to be going over a lot of changes happening to Frostbite here uh, within the next couple weeks. So definitely stay tuned. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Hit that like button. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.